he's a dapper man eh too much estrogen going on so some testosterone over here eh, did i didn't say it correctly guys <laughs> he's a dj tv dj he's one of us by the way he's an entrepreneur he's a producer let's welcome dj sadi sandiki lakini sadik tunaanza straight kwa interview straight kwa interview mbona dj sadik and what's your real name wow uh Nilisome, nilisomea high school shule inaitwa Isili High School. Mm-hmm. So hata niseme marafiki wangu ama classmates wengi walikuwa Muslims. Uh-huh. So hiyo alini walikubatiza. Yeah, I was going to ask uh, you're a Christian but yeah. you have a Muslim Muslim. Eh, Islam. But ina maanisha ina maanisha friend. Uh-huh. Um, oh, eh, wow. Na kwa kwa Kiswahili pia kusadiki uh-huh. ni kama ni kama <laughs> reverence. <laughs> Eh, yeah. yeah. ni kama reverence kwa God hivi. So yeah. nili nili nilitembea tu nayo na yeah. kila mtu akaizoea walimu wakaanza kuniita hivyo. Ah. Kila mtu akashika hiyo jina but ya kitambulisho ni Malvin Sande. Ama ni hiyo Sande. Sande. Haki ukai kuitwa Malvin. Eh, mal- sasa ya mtaani yeah. niki grow shauri yeah. moyo walikuwa wanaita Malo. Walikuwa kuita Malo. Yeah. Malo. Eh. Malo. So tell us about the journey. When did you realize um you are passionate about DJing mm-hmm. and music and when did you decide you know it's time for me to pursue this? Okay. Mm-hmm. Uh nilikuwa mnoisi sana pale home. <laughs> uh, nilianza kutengeneza yeah. nilitengeneza drum kit yangu tu na utensils za madhe. Yeah. So kuna kabesi na po alafu kuna hizi vikombe za mabati hiyo yeah. ndio ilikuwa ka high hat yeah. so every time nilikuwa na nacheza cheza tu vitu so kuna time alikuwa anasema napiga kelele akarudi akaona ni kama kuna kitu na huu mtoi yeah. so akaacha kuzusha so ilikuwa tu nacheza drums zangu hapo so at that time i used to go to church inaitwa Shauri Moyo Baptist hapo Shauri mm-hmm. so one one saturday nikiwapo church nikachukua two drumsticks nikaanza ku play mm-hmm. so kumbe the guy mwenye yu cheza church alikuwa nyuma yangu tu akini watch mm-hmm. so anasikia nikifanya vitu niki practice niki practice mm-hmm. akakuja akaniambia wewe ucheza drums wapi mm-hmm. kaambia i've never played Dad. anywhere akaniambia eh hey, napenda sana naweza nataka kuku polish wow. ikaanza hivyo so yeye akani polish nikaanza kumsaidia ile siku yuko service na cheza drums kwa church wow. ikaanza hivyo then yeye alikuwa anacheza drums na there was a keyboard guy mm-hmm. so the keyboard guy akaanza kunifundisha basic keys tu uh-huh. so na hizo keyboard iko na place unaweza tengeneza beats pia so we started making tracks kwa keyboard hiyo mm-hmm. time tulikuwa tunazi save kwa diskette eh, 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 disc floppy disk fl- floppy <laughs> so yeah. nilikuwa yani active nikimaliza kucheza kwa present worship yeah. na zile beats tulitengeneza na rap nazo kwa service yani hapo ndo ukaanza production hapo ndo nikaanza hizo story na, na mm-hmm kuandika andika ngoma kiasi so yeah. na piga drums kwa service na rap na imba nilikuwa <laughs> na song ilikuwa inaitwa na bado hiyo time wewe <laughs> tulikuwa na imba hadi eh so hapo hapo ndo nilianza kuandika eh mbona ukaacha muziki sasa ndio kosi kwa muziki eh sija sija wacha mm-hmm. wacha niseme uliata kuimba dj ili <laughs> DJ ili ili take over uh-huh. eh, unakuta mo, moja ina ina overpower ingine. Uh-huh. But sasa I'm back uh-huh. and I'm producing other guys as well so, Nice yeah. but why did you lean more on the gospel mm-hmm. music yeah. more like kuna secular pia but uh-huh. why did you choose cuz mimi nilianza kuona kitambo tu because we need other pages of Bible. Bible. Yeah. yeah why gospel uh, first of all I think faith number one, mm-hmm. because nime nime grow up kwa Christian background na hivyo nimekwambia nilianza ku play church so that's like hiyo ndio ilikuwa foundation mm-hmm. so even wakati nilianza kufanya mziki ili lean to towards your direction yeah. because of faith yangu pia mm-hmm. ah nice yeah. but also speaking of gospel music mm-hmm. i'll ask you this and yeah. i'm not putting you on, on the spot on the spot but you're on the spot <laughs> we are on the spot <laughs> <laughs> but so you kuna gospel there's so much talk around gospel music yeah. and people are not being taken serious because of what you guys i mean music gospel musicians are doing so what yeah. is your take on this this issue okay uh kuna time ilifika uh, watu wakakuwa na opinion about gospel music yeah. that gospel yeah. music kwa gospel kuna do yeah hiyo mm-hmm. ndio ilikuwa assumption mm-hmm. so a lot of guys started coming into it ah. with the wrong motive So unakuta mtu anaona eh hey, kama uko ndio kuna pesa ra, nitafanya tu for the sake of it. Yeah. So unakuta mimi sema most of the time utakuta watu wanasema kuna watu wa waimbi real gospel mm-hmm. 
na kuna watu wanaimba real gospel <laughs> so mimi usema badala ya ku badala ya kufocus on wale hawaimbi hiyo yeah. real gospel according to you mm-hmm. promoter hao wanafanya the real gospel the real. eh but kama nani ah uh, what anseme kwa mfano eh uh, unajua kikawaida watu wata watasema sarakei yeah. maybe anaimba gospel unis njeri kambua unaona guardian angel Ga, unaona but yeah. Pia kila mtu hezi imba, kila mtu hezi imba the same thing. Kila mtu hezi imba worship, kila mtu yeah. hezi imba. So kuna a certain audience ya vijana ambao guardian will appeal to, mm-hmm. ambao moji short baba will appeal mm-hmm. to. So kuna target audience pia but still, in, I manishi content kwe diluted yeah. but kuna mziki ambayo, uh, utakuta there is a mtoi wako yeah. unaweza kuta eh hey, maybe hata sikiza sarake yeah. but when moji short baba comes on ana, yeah, ana enjoy ana the vibe chakuka. so beats beats ni zile zile vibe mm. ni ile ile but difference ni ile content koko mm. hiyo and i just have to ask this eh? you yeah. have a record label yes. and um you've signed a couple of artists mm-hmm. right yeah. so do you mentor like young artists and are you um, do you also produce like other you know the, this the secular side of it mm-hmm. or you are just basically you major on you know um gospel christian music okay. and those are the kind of people that you mentor. Okay. Mm-hmm. Uh, wakati kitu lilinisukuma sana ku, kuanzisha record label ilikuwa most of the time artists used to come to me because I'm on TV, I'm mm-hmm. playing on radio, mm-hmm. wananiletea songs ni wacheze. Mm-hmm. But sometimes unasikiza unasikia eh hii song maybe haikumixiwa poa, haikumastariwa ah. poa, something could be changed. Mm-hmm. So nikasema instead of kila saa kuambia rudi kwa producer fanya mm-hmm. nikaona inaweza inaweza kuwa my input back to the industry mm-hmm. I just start a label mali pia nitaweza kusaidia wasanii wengine there are those artists who afford to pay for the sessions yeah. kuna wengine hata hiyo 10k or 15k for a song hana mm-hmm. so nilijua niliona naweza step in kwa hiyo space kujaribu kusaidia mm-hmm. na when it comes to recording uh, Apart from gospel music I record positive music. Yaani mm-hmm. kuna wa say they are not gospel artists yeah. but wanaimba muziki poa, yeah. good social songs. Yeah. I don't mind recording that. Bora si valga. Yeah. I see na issue. We had we had Guardian here last yeah. week and him and I've also had um wisdom mm-hmm. gospel musician yeah. and also bahati all mm-hmm. of them talk about there being cartels in the gospel industry. Uh-huh. Do you believe there are cartels? Uh Wacha ni, wacha ni seme, story ya cartels ilianza na sisi. Hiyo okay. hiyo story ya cartel because uh, there were units before. Be- yeah, system unit. Uh, even Genius. before before system unit there All was right. there was Kubamba, uh-huh. kulikuwa na nyingine ilikuwa inaitwa Gospel Epic ya DJ Rick, but mm-hmm. when we started system unit ilikuja na such a big bang. Mm-hmm. So tulikuwa tuko mimi niko hapo, Alemba ako hapo, Mo ako hapo. Then we started mentoring guys to ka, we brought DK kwenye beat on board we brought Hope Kid on board so it was a big movement yeah. so watu kukaanza kuwa na hiyo assumption ya lazima ukue system yeah. ndio uchezwe ah. kwa the shows that we were playing yeah. on TV but it was just an assumption i can't play Hope Kid and DK the whole show yeah. tulikuwa tunacheza so. kila mtu mm-hmm. ni vile tuliamua tu as a unit tutashika mkono watu kadhaa mm-hmm. so mimi upenda kusema hivi <laughs> if unaona hao wase wameshikana na wako na movement that works yeah. shikana na mwingine mcreate yenu true yeah, so is it, is it the reason <laughs> ulitoka system unit tuka create yako genius record not really uh, you know sometimes mnaweza kuwa mna work pamoja yeah. but maybe there's a certain direction wewe unataka kuenda ah. yenye ni tofauti kidogo ah. na the other guys ah. so si ati tuliko sana ama kulikuwa na beef mm-hmm. nili feel tu imefika time nime nime grow na naweza taka pia kujaribu kufanya right. things my Let way yako, eh, yeah, yeah, but yeah. still agenda ni moja ah. tuna push agenda ya Christ yeah Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, so I just have to ask current situation in the country coronavirus. <laughs> Saifa ndio kuna mashow show ni wewe kwa yeah. social media platforms zako. Kweli. So how do you feel like the COVID-19 has affected you as mm-hmm. a DJ yeah. and you are normal working you're going to on a day to day basis regularly. Yeah. yeah. Imekuwa mm-hmm. imekuwa noma sana because uh, first of all I I run a DJ school. Mm-hmm. Um, I run an academy where I teach I teach DJing and I teach production. Mm-hmm. So automatically students are wakuji mm-hmm. because majority the biggest number ni high schoolers na excans wale wamemaliza shule. So high school. Bado wako kwa wazazi. Oh. So yeah. wanaambiwa eh, stay at home. Yeah. So shule ka affected. Mm-hmm. Wasanii pia hawakuji for studio sessions as often as mm-hmm. walikuwa na wanakuja yeah. because of hiyo sorry tu ya social distance mm-hmm. and stuff mm-hmm. we uh, gigs nilikuwa na couple of gigs lined up for mm-hmm. like for the rest of the year zikakuwa cancelled mm-hmm. so i think ime, especially for the entertainment industry mm-hmm. imekuwa yeah. a big big blow 
But so yeah. na ile mambo yako hivyo social media the way like you know guys have had to like, become more creative <laughs> mm-hmm. na kutumia platforms zao kwenye social media yeah. to get through to their fans mm-hmm. entertain their fans yeah. is that what you're up to Yeah that's what I'm doing currently uh-huh. I have I have online shows na mm-hmm. I used to do I had started an event mm-hmm. okay see si started ilikuwa nikapose nika nikairudisha tena mm-hmm. inaitwa club 316 mm-hmm. so we used to do it up at all every friday mm-hmm. Then I had started another monthly gig in it overflow mm-hmm. which means hizo pia nikaf kuzisimamisha so mm-hmm. nimepeleka tuyo club 316 online sasa mm-hmm. so I go live uh, on Thursday Friday and Sunday Oh you have dates Yes na sasa una plugging over there timing Yeah Wambia so siku Yeah Thursday uh-huh. Thursday Thursday and Friday I go live from 8 mm-hmm. to 10 pm mm-hmm. Sunday I go live from 4 pm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yes. and we still have our DJ in studio. <laughs> yeah. Tafadhali msiende, we gotta go on a short break. We'll be right back. All right. Welcome back. Na bado tuko na DJ Sadi kwenye hot seats hapa hivi ya on this spot na lazima tuuze zile maswala nyeti eh <laughs> lakini keep calm i'm gonna get there yeah. so dj sadik yes. recently ume join our home switch mm. tv Not and sure. you are hosting um co-hosting with um joyce yes, kwa show yake asubuhi tell us about it wow uh, mm. i think god work in mysterious Na ways karibu <laughs> asante eh, sana Uh, <laughs> God work in mysterious ways because mm-hmm. I just came as a guest mm-hmm. for the for the two Easter shows mm-hmm. the Good Friday and Easter Monday yeah. shows after hizo shows zikaenda poa sana mm-hmm. nikapigiwa simu na management nikaambiwa tume like job mm-hmm. unaweza penda kukuona sisi permanently mm-hmm. wow. kasema definitely why mm-hmm. not unaona yeah, so, tukiwaita nyinyi <laughs> ma guest mnakuja unaweza land ya job <laughs> Yeah so ilikuwa tu rahisi hivyo. Eh na mimi nashukuru God for you. Amazing karibu sana like we're happy I'm always happy to yeah. see you know the farm grows bigger Big, as yeah. in you know. Definitely. And you also have a show. Utaenda show yake. Sasa God za tu mtu ni venye nataka ku grill sadiki designer. Na grill hiyo. So watu wanapenda reggae probably maybe umepatana maybe ukiwa reggae mali umepatana na Sadiq over here mm-hmm. ako ameenda ku support na jama boys wake akicheza reggae mm-hmm. and you know um, you play maybe once mm-hmm. kidogo yes. unaenda unashika decks hapo hivyo mm-hmm. um, tell us about it do you feel like sometimes people are judgmental that like unafanya nini okay. reggae yeah. yeah. tu wangu unafai kwa unaongoza sana ndio ende kanisa ukapinde huko utapiga na na hata si reggae peke yake mm-hmm. any uh, wacha nianze kusema by niko na a lot of Uh, friends wale ni secular DJs mm-hmm. secular artists wengi sana yani hata niki mention mm-hmm. siezi maliza like mm-hmm. i know the entire industry mm-hmm. uh, both gospel na secular ni mabeshte yeah. wangu so when i do when i do my things when i have my events even mm-hmm. comedians mm-hmm. they come and support me mm-hmm. sionangi any issue to go and support yeah, them support when they have their nights uh, so yeah. alafu most of the time utakuta most of the my, our secular counterparts now mm-hmm. When it comes to their birthdays wanazifanya kwa clubs Club, yeah. unaona especially even uh, the DJs wanafanya anniversary zao hapo wanafanya birthday zao hapo mm-hmm. i go and support mm-hmm. na mimi usema hata unieke kwa club mm-hmm. provided i'm playing gospel music nitacheza mm-hmm. well, i don't have an issue because au ndo watu tumekoliwa ku reach out to them mm-hmm. yeah. another Locked thing ship, eh? yes <laughs> there's a time i posted a photo with uh, a secular DJ mtu uh, someone alikomentwa kaniambia mwambie okoke mm-hmm. unaona so sidhani inafaa kwa hivyo sidhani kila time nikipatana na more spice ama chris darling ama whoever namwambia okoka like uh-huh. life yangu inafaa ku preach more than hata vitu nawaambia yeah. eh. what you do yeah kama oh, kuna yeah. even even the fans wale wana to watch mm-hmm. as much as tunawaambia eh hey, god anawapenda na nini na nini anafuatua check lifestyle ya sadika one njaro za huo boy yani mimi zinanibamba na kama salvation inakaa hivi mimi si mind uh-huh. na pia salvation doesn't have to be boring as well that's yeah, why utasikia hata kwa sets zangu mimi I'm a gospel DJ but I play a lot of reggae. Yaani watu wananijua hey, na hey, reggae. Unasikia no. mali amedungilia hapo. Eh, hey, mimi napenda. We have a re- show <laughs> Friday. Uko hapa Friday? Eh. Hey. Hey, I'll pre- drag you to it that evening. Ni premiere yeah. just the other day hey. na show normal sana. Yeah, yeah, yeah. so mi yani amesema eh. Hey. <laughs> eh asha sema eh tuna Oh nea hiyo siezi ruka. Eh hakuna kuruka Sadika taka vibes ya man. Sadika mimi nitakuuliza mm-hmm. yeah. since you play all this kind of music the mm-hmm. reggae and you can possibly just do like play any mm-hmm. kind of music mm-hmm. ikuwe bora ni gospel. Sometimes utakuta ni kwa wedding eh. Mm-hmm. Kwa wedding atuendi 
it's not 90% that worship songs not as a wedding such as a love songs hapo yeah and here this is where i slide in my question now how do you feel about secular gospel artists mm-hmm. collaborating with secular artists kwanza wa genge yeah. genge tone mm-hmm. like what's your view <laughs> my my view nitasema hivi eh yeah. uh, inategemea na agenda ya mtu ni nini right. kuna many reasons why an artist would choose to go that direction mm-hmm. number one, mtu anaweza kuwa naona niki niki collab na umse nitakuwa na mvuta nitakuwa na mvuta hii side yetu ya gospel unaona hiyo nakataa no nasema i'm just keep cap i'm just painting a picture okay. eh, right. like yeah. Yeah. vile mtu anaweza fikiria mm-hmm. anaona the moment nita collab na wa say yeah. ni kama na wa show love na wavuta hii side hiyo inaweza kuwa one reason mm-hmm. second reason mtu anaweza kuwa pia hivyo unasema anataka avu, av, avute pia mafans wa hiyo wa hiyo side hii pande nyingine mm-hmm. Another reason would be purely business. Yeah. That's why inasema inategemea na agenda ya mm. mtu. Kuna mtu yeye ni kibiashara. Yeye anaona tu <laughs> yeah. ni song na umse ita trend iende agenda yeah, tofauti. Yeah, yeah. Mimi what I don't mm. most of the times what I don't have okay. an issue with right. is sometimes utakuta kuna what secular artists wanafanya gospel songs. Nyashinsky did a, 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 a gospel song, yeah. Sauti Sol amefanya gospel song, Ben Sol amefanya gospel song. Uh, ata internationally Kinkata amefanya gospel song called Kafiri hata Unaona? Unaona? Ah, okay. yeah. <laughs> Yo, mimi mimi in my personal opinion at internationally kuna uh-huh. uh, kama shagi yeah. al- so in my personal opinion you mm-hmm. can't limit who god can use but yeah. i feel like don't you cannot give us lyrics mm-hmm. just because iko na the word god ni gospel that's, Aya, what, that's, what, I was going. that's what i was going that's what i was going that's what i was going i wonder if god have mentioned god but no, no. you that, that's where i was going All right. content kama kama content ni biblically correct mm-hmm. yani hata kama ni because as much as tuna hiyo secular ni tag tuliweke ya mtu he ni human being mm-hmm. wengine wako na personal relationship na god mm-hmm. i'll give an example mimi na dj joe tume grow pamoja sunday school moja yeah. unaona yeah. yeah. yali decide attend direction, direction ya yeah. secular yeah. as a business yeah. but bado personal relationship yake na god iko intact mm-hmm. unaona but bible ni so at ways not be yoked do not be unequally yoked with unbelievers hiyo topic inakuanga very wide hauwezi yeah. maliza because ukienda kwa duka unauliza anga shopkeeper wewe umeokoka ka hujaokoka si bike kwa wako so it's like an ambiguous statement unaona naweza kuwa mini gospel artist but ingo nimevaa sijui nani aliitengeneza <laughs> sijui kama ni <laughs> atheist ama ni gay ama ni i don't know yeah. unaona so hiyo topic inakuanga inakuanga very wide na kui right. so hapo i think ni a personal decision mtu anaamua mimi naenda hii direction because of abcd reason yeah. but you can't limit mtu god anaweza tumia mm. kuna watu maybe waliokoka through song ya nyashinski ya mungu pekee we don't know yeah. na sometimes unakuta hawa tunaita secular artists they do deeper gospel songs than wale sasa somebody shout amen <laughs> as we move on God, God is in control. control. Oh, I love you. Yes. <laughs> and the situation. Anyway guys, it's so Yo talent, yo talent ya au secular. Nani amewapatia? Ni God ametupea talent sisi wote. But still. Nana, it's a personal relationship. Wewe na Mungu wako na imani yako mtu wangu. Sawa? Yes. Eh ukasome Biblia for the rest. Anyway, it's time for game spot. We? Okay. Niko, niko tu hapa naambia na na tulia, 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 stop yeah. grinding uh, DJ Sadik that much yeah. so kila mtu atakuwa na karatasi yake hapa please we are going to play <laughs> never have i ever right. so this is where kama umefanya uninua karatasi na i have na kama hujafanya unaika sedia ni kwa jesus christ so never have i ever convinced a friend to dump a partner guy mimi kama wewe ni toxic mtu wangu I'm an advocate for time. dump and live like it never happened. <laughs> and Flash block it. Flash. Mimi <laughs> I just mind my own business. Ni muamue. Sunday. Really? Joy, I don't believe that. Hey, 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 but you know for guys it's very different. Yeah. But no also you guys yes, tell guys where well, chana na huyo day mawezi. Anachoma. Ha, tunakucheki. Aya never have I ever convinced a partner to dump a friend. A friend sasa. Yes. Uh-huh. No it's vice versa. Hii ngine ni ujambe uh-huh. beshtia kwa dump dem yake. Mtu ana date. Eh. Uh-huh. Na sasa hii ni ile unaambia dem yako a dump mabeshte wako wake. Uh-huh. wake. Uh-huh. 
Toxic. Eh kuna mtu wangu hapa nikadagiagia 7k iko. I think that the best yako kuna kila time especially mtu na date alafu madem mabesti wake naona ni kama namwambia hapana mimi sio. Rosa safi hapo at least to me agree the table has agreed. Never have I ever been someone else's alibi. I have. Enough time. In what you are depend in doing what? No ever. In any place. We sadik tulikuwa na we. Oh that's crazy. Uh, never have I ever snitched on someone else at work. Uh, yeah, as it no. snitches don't last yo man. Yeah, snitches get stitches. Yeah, it is. <laughs> yes, yes, that one. Never have I ever donated an organ of <laughs> uh, Never. Abo, Th- does blood count? Blood in account of yes, uh, blood is your organ. Lakini hata hapo kwa blood ni kibarua. Eh wewe what? Never have I ever lied to a law enforcement officer. Ai all the time. Okay, mm. tafakarini ni kitambo atuongelele leo. Okay? <laughs> Umesema oh, never. I have. Yeah. Mimi nataka hey. kusikia scenario yangu acha niwaambie yangu yeah. niko. Na wrong turn ikianza ku drive mtu wangu tao. Eh. Wewe mimi sikukua na DL ukweli ilipoteanga uh-huh. niko nayo sasa hii by the way. Uh-huh. Afande I have it. Yes. <laughs> eh akanikuta akanize iko wapi DL nikamwambia gai unajua nime exchange gari na bwanangu uh-huh. sasa nimeiacha kwa gari yangu afande pole. But na wewe sadi kulidanganya. Eh yangu yangu ni kama ni kama ilikuwa uongo na ni kama ilikuwa kweli. <laughs> <laughs> nilikuwa naenda nilikuwa naenda show i had a saturday afternoon show back mm-hmm. then yeah. lakini sasa sikumwambia naenda show uh-huh. nilimwambia unaona hii hard disk nimeshika uh-huh. news za saa moja ziko hapa <laughs> oh my <laughs> news god news za 7 ziko hapa <laughs> yani mimi nisipofika uh-huh. mimi sijui utaambia je mimi nitakupea tu simu uonge nao juu <laughs> Alafu akaanza kuniangalia kana ah we ni wa media nakujua kuna kamera kwa hii gari nikamwambia afande afande enda 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 we bada na news za sabana okay never buy ever um cutting line on purpose oh lord mi kwanza super najifanyanga hata sioni hadi siku za corona Una joking ile ya mlango different upate Q nenda na huko ndo mingia na huko na ni slide tu hapo. Shake at line na nikaangaliwa vibaya sana. Basi ukalenga. Ah. Una jamia nga tu shame on me shame on me but hey. Okay. Um never have I ever held a grudge longer than a year my guy. Eh mimi ni mbaya na hiyo. Tunaweka kuweka. Eh hata mimi navurutanga. Mimi nakavuta nakavuta sana. Unaivuta kuvuta. Aya never have ever um I'm looking for the interesting ones. Blabbered something I swore to secrecy. I have. I'm a happy. Oh, why? Ko blabber ni kuropoka. Kitu ulikumesema utasema, ukasahau ukasema. I have. Gosh. Uh, I mean this happens. I mean, you forget and po- then like time. Yeah, Inaponyox. <laughs> Cindy. Yeah. Okay, never have I ever um let me see, let me see. I'm looking for the juicy ones. Never have I ever thought a friend's baby was ugly. As in it's a baby. Eh. Ah, never. <laughs> Ni mtoi mtu wangu. Kwa mtoto sina maana. Mimi nasema anga kama hujazaa manze eh. do not hit on a child a baby. Man. Especially Oh, this one is interesting. Never have I ever accidentally said I love you to someone. Accidentally. Ukiwa things. Unajua ukiwa things in your accident. Uh. <laughs> baby manze. <laughs> Hapo kwa accidentally <laughs> yeah, yeah, kuna time unasema na umaanishi ah, sijui kama hiyo ni accidentally umesema tu Mama amekwambia I love you Unashindwa sana ni sema thank you Sitaki ku break heart yako so you know what I love you too Lakini unajua wageto ni noma wageto unamwambia I love you anakuambia Akidi ni wabaya guys Wageto anakuambia strong So never have I ever snooped through a friend's room cabinets or property If I'm interested, I need to know where I slept. I mean, I, I know I have. Who is it Costa? You know those people who hit on you. Lazima ukienda tu snoop. Unajua una just like snooping get you, you know the kind of a person me and excuse yangu by the way. Yeah, the kind of person so, to ako so, ndio. Eh, wapata uko mtoko ndio yeah. za psycho. Yeah, mimi mimi <laughs> tiki mimi ni snoop. Unajua ushagoa kunanga milango. So nipazia tu. Unataka kujua nini inaendelea tu. So unajulia. Sadi kwa why you snooping? Instances ni more. Lakini pia you are a snooper. Nikitembelea Okay. Snoop Dog. Snoop Dog. <laughs> 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 oh my god. 
That was really fun. So, Dave, mm. as yes. we wind up the mm -hmm. show, tell us, man, you know, as in 2020 is here, what should we expect? What's in store for us? Wow, una jo moka ikianza kila mtu alisema this is my year. Wewe wacha. Sasa corona imetuangalia hivi. <laughs> Lakini I think ni ni time poa sana ya ku unajua sometimes pia unakimbia sana kwa life. Yeah. Ni kama sometimes pia God anakuambia tu yeah, kahora tulia yeah. kidogo. So ni time poa ya ku slow down, ku reflect nini umekuwa kidu poa, nini ume, ujakuwa kidu poa, what can you adjust? Sometimes unakuta umekuwa na hizo tunasema unnecessary grudges. Una, kama mimi nime kill mingi sana mm. eh yeah, una yani ni time tu ya ku reflect na ku, ku do things different do na especially for us as creatives mm. ni time pia ya ku create yeah. so that kama mimi niko na like ngoma nimekuwa na record mangoma mob na ngoja two time ifike pia eh yeah, pia kumekuwa na hiyo limitation muwezi shoot videos juu ya eh. crowds kwa crew na vitu kaizo so nimekuwa tu na create na create na create but so, like tunani bamba ni yeah. like you guys can catch DJ Sadik every friday on full circle today yeah, so manze, on from Monday. Eight, yeah. Yeah. yeah we can't wait to see that na imagine time yetu imeisha yeah, plug in kwa yona kupata social media, social media platforms. handles at mm -hmm. DJ Sadik on all platforms yeah. alafu juzi tu nimeingia tiktok so ni follow in hapo amina ni bamba hey. 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 I'm struggling so can you find that stone and up behind kwenye dm ni kwenye DM Facebook, yeah, Twitter, I'll Instagram, uh -huh. Snapchat, uh, TikTok, at DJ Sadik. DJ S A D I C. Yeah. Yeah. Guys, <laughs> we's out. We'll see you tomorrow, <laughs> same time, same Peace. place, chat spot. Thanks for keeping in. Bye bye. 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 <laughs>